All right, guys, we've been taking a look at a lot of map concepts lately for Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 8, so my friend and I decided to let's dive in and take a look at our own. I'm not going to talk about it forever because this is part of a bigger, bigger video, so we're going to take a look at the map. I'm going to talk about it very quickly, and again, just keep in mind, I have a video coming out of an entire Chapter 2 Season 8 concept. This is just a very small part of it. This is going to be the map, so stay tuned for that video, and I'll show off the map. And here it is, guys. This is the best we could do for Chapter 2 Season 8. I personally think it looks great, so... Again, like I said, this is going to be a part of a bigger story, and I'm just going to summarize the story for you because, again, big video coming soon. Big video coming soon. So, Dr. Sloan was successful. Shot down the mothership. The mothership crashed down on the island, and that is where you're getting all the gray. That is complete aftermath type stuff right on the left of the map is like so blown up it's like walking on like dead land so it's all grayed out crazy plus we wanted to get in the halloween theme you know so we have some halloween themes going on around here you see the purple up at the top the new brand new purple biome that's just where the aliens decide to reside there's some survivors on the mothership again we'll be explaining a little bit more we're just gonna work from the top down you'll see on the outskirts of the map we have some yachts so a lot of people there also with them we have all the aliens still on the map and we have shadow midas returning eh, a little bit of a hint shadow mad is returning and we have all the zombies and the ghouls coming back with them so the loopers are trying to get away so they built boats and it's kind of like run down boats like deadpool's yacht if that makes sense yeah, so that's why we put deadpool's yacht there it's like to get it's not exactly deadpool's yacht but it's a broken down boat kind of like that if that makes sense we also see a lot of prisons on the map we see a lot of prisons kind of all over the place people like taking think of like the walking dead type thing that's where i was trying that's where mine where my mind was going to be honest with you so, Blacksmith's Barrier, long story short, it's a brand new medieval type thing. It's the stronghold is back up. The walls are perfectly sealed to keep the zombies out. There's another story with that one, but I'm not going to talk about that just yet. Moving on, we have Spooky Sands and Witch's Watchtower. Holly Hatchery is all still there. And keep in mind, guys, this is a complete biome change. This is something that Fortnite really needs more of. It's a completely new biome. That's why I also added snow at the bottom, but we will get to that in fog and destroyed land and a purple biome. It just... It's a whole, it brings a new quality of life to the game. It, it keeps the game fresh way more than people think. And I, I personally think we need biomes. That's just all we need. And we're, there's different game mechanics going on in these POIs here. But again, you'll have to wait for that. I apologize to keep saying that, but I, I want to explain, but at the same time, not really explaining. Rituals we birth right in the center of the map. That is a big, big mountain that has spawned. And under it is Savage Springs. It is just Salty Springs, but a little bit spookier. We're going to go with the storyline of the chapter two map is kind of rolling back into the chapter one version of itself so salty springs is starting to show up there's going to be a little bit more showing up throughout the season anyways we see foggy fields and possessed pass that is all part of the zombies as are permanently going to be their fog in possessed pass and fall in foggy fields possessed pass there's a couple more houses there Corny is destroyed in Foggy Fields, you know, the bomb going off and stuff like that. Again, we will explain a little bit more of that. You will also see the big return of the block. The block is something that I am still upset is gone from the game. To show off all the players' creativity and all the stuff that people can make in the map, they can sometimes do better than Epic Games, to be honest with you. The block needs to still be on the map. It, it's, it's a necessity, in my opinion. It's not a map without the block. To have that community, like to show the community some love to like let the community to hop, hop in and try to put something on the fortnite map it's something really special the block needs to stick around you could like tell players you know what hey let's make a spooky themed block and then do you know how many people go on that especially with creative now we even had the block since chapter one and creative is a completely different game we need the block i miss the block the map isn't the map without the block we also moving on we see the remains that is the empty grotto and it's going to be filled with zombies for <laughs> this awesome awesome halloween season four nightmares is going to be a lot of fun guys and going down we have creepy cabins a lot of people wanted to take shelter in the redacted bunker but unfortunately io's guarding it and they can't get in so they ended up building little cabins it's pretty it's it's pretty sad and run down a little bit depressed looking it's creepy cabins for you a lot of people live in there and you might find some good fights there. there's gonna be a little bit more loot we gotta bring that gotta get that lower bit of the map going you know what i mean we more people need to land there and that's why i also expanded the snow biome because i was just talking about it brings it it helps the quality of life in fortnite a lot it really does it goes a long way so we extended the snow by him a little bit on top of that preparing for christmas it'll be snowing there remember the blizzards you remember the blizzards in fortnite chapter 2 season 1 a lot of you quit back then but i stuck with it it was a great time so that's gonna happen over there and camp cod in the snow one of my personal favorite locations camp cod 
unchanged but snowy i guess that means it did change right <laughs> and guys the final change on the map here is buried broadcasting you know what i am i apologize but i'm gonna have to keep that a secret again i don't know how many times i said that i just don't I, i'm trying to get through this video quick even though we've probably been talking for a little while now because i wanted to show off the map concept that's what i wanted to do for this video but at the same time i didn't want to spoil everything so buried broadcasting is the only one you're not going to know about because that's super super special for the season 8 concept so guys let me know what you think of this map concept and i'm i still no matter what we can't compete with funny cat man you can't compete with funny cat you you got me oh one thing i forgot stony steps you know sunny steps was on the mothership when it was crashing down it's sunny steps just fell out of it that's pretty much what goes on there <laughs> so blacksmith barrier buried broadcasting you're not allowed to know about but you will find out shortly guys let me know what you think about this map concept and who, thank you to my one of my awesome 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 friends grant goche for making the map he has a youtube channel if you want to go check it out grant goche if you like karate bow stuff any of that feel free to go check it out i'll leave a link for that in the, in the description or the pinned comment down below i don't remember which one i'll do probably both <laughs> thank you so much for watching again guys if you're new here and you enjoy the content please consider the like button it would help out the channel ton and subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this smash bros and or just regular fortnite content we're branching out a little bit too i started a new channel it's called i don't know what it's called yet because i didn't make the channel yet but <laughs> it'll be about ufc and mma so if you're interested in that go check out the link down in the description down below speaking of the description i will also have a link for real ember on fiverr if you like my thumbnails if you're looking to be a youtuber you need thumbnails go check out real ember i have absolutely nothing but things to say about him this you're not going to get any thumbnails you're, that are better and you're not going to get a better person i'm telling you the best absolutely the best what else do I need to plug in here? I have a shorts channel called Clun Shorts. Uh, follow me on TikTok at Clun underscore YT. I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to get used to all these plugins, man. It's tough. I have a Discord server. If you want to come in and share some concepts, talk about concepts, talk about Fortnite, Smash Bros, UFC, whatever you want, just join my Discord server. Also, link for that in the description down below. If you'd like to use my supporter creator code in the item shop, it is Clun Coco. Hashtag ad I may. Hashtag epic partner. Thank you again for watching, guys. I will see you in the next video. Take care.